I'm not sure if you guys can see it or not, but the new rental car has a spider somewhere up here. Is it big? No. It's a baby spider. And why bother vlogging it? Because it's a spider. It's Halloween related. Spider. <laughs> there he is. Ah! Yeah! Yeah! Kill it! Spider's dead. Are you happy now? Yes. Alright guys, so we've been out and we've looked at a couple more cars. If that's what you want to call them. Yeah. It looked like they were in some kind of gangsta deals or something. Whoa. <laughs> I mean, the car was like exactly like mine, one year newer. And walking up to it, you can see the whole side is all dented and scratched. And you open up the inside, the interior is all ripped up and stinky and gross and stained and scratched. I'm like, what the hell is a person doing this car? Did they sit there and go like this with a knife? <laughs> you would be surprised. I worked on some cars that, okay, sometimes we put like the, the, the floor mats and the plastic on the seats to protect the car from us. There are some cars that I put that stuff in there to protect me from the car because it was kind of freaking nasty. This camera sucks on the batteries, and I don't know why. I just put new batteries in it before I left the house this morning, so I don't... Anyway. Yeah, but it's your Halloween battery, so... Well, yeah. But anyway, so I want to cut this right now. Hopefully the next frame or the next clip will be us, like, around the car or something. What are you doing to me? <laughs> okay, so we don't have the car yet. It's not a done deal, but it's not a past deal anyway and you guys haven't even seen it yet so we're doing some more running around today there's just like all this running around to do we're at Wally World again Lori Lee is inside I'm gonna go pick her up but guys it is just so funny to sit here and watch people cars and traffic it's not like a dance to where you know a ballet a beautiful ballet this is like the awkward guy getting out on stage and doing a dance people waiting for people I don't understand just park and walk just park and walk it's the Santa imposter again. Ring, ring, ring. So Lori Lee and I were walking down and we heard this one kind of like older lady say, ooh, that's gross. So of course, we have to of go and look. Of course you had to look. We had to look. So this is what she was saying gross about. Ew. <laughs> oh. It's gummy. There you go. You're so cute right now. Isn't she cute, guys? What'd I do? What? Do you have in your mouth? All right. <laughs> <laughs> wow. A rat can last longer without water than a camel. Really? Apparently so. This one's not dried up yet. Wow. You're eating its butt. Ew. <laughs> Look. You ate its butt. That's just nasty. Anti-rat butt. But good news. All right. Do we think it's good news? Yeah. Is it good news? I think so. She got a phone call, y'all. Car, no car. Car, no car. What are we doing now? Car. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I mean, I'm not fully happy about it because I have to drop some money on it, you know, but... It's it is, a sexy car. It is what it is. I mean, it's, things happen in life, but it just seems to happen more often to me. <laughs> it's a sexy car. <laughs> Wow. So, no car. <laughs> um, we are getting it. And thank you, camera person, you. <laughs> um, we are getting it. Um, it's just that, long story short, but I am going to show you guys what it looks like. And it doesn't look like that. So, here it is, guys. We're going to pick it up Monday morning. But it's so sexy. <laughs> 2009. Hyundai! <laughs> it's so pretty. It's hey, 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 hey. We did it. <laughs> oh, don't look that way. It's sexy. Yes, I know, but I have to say bye to $4. Eh, well, it's worth it. JD and I are happy. <laughs> yeah, I bet you are. <sighs> so pretty. Huh. Yay, I have a place to put my damn sunglasses. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. And this stuff. 
every time I'm driving, oh, if they don't have one on this side, that's it, I'm not buying it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this right here. I want one right there because this is where the sun comes in, right here. The, well, that's what sunglasses are for. It's an extendivisor. That's it. I'm not buying it. <laughs> <laughs> time has passed. It is now time to try to finish the Christmas lights. So it's going to be like Christmas lights putting a bitch on crack. Okay, well, not really. But anyway, so we were able to find another string. I know I make myself laugh all the time. You guys would be surprised. Actually, you probably wouldn't. We found the, the last string of Christmas lights from Fred Meyer when we were there today. You guys saw that. So now I'm going to go and finish the whites and try to finish the yard so that we can get the tree and stuff inside up and make it more Christmassy. I think this is all the lights that I'm going to do this year. Just white ones around the yard and this stuff up top. And I am done. Uh, the unfortunate thing is, is the strand right here of the white icicle lights. The plug right here. Uh, had an open in it so as I was putting it together the lights were like on off on off on off I found the problem which is a small little resistor inside this little package right here yeah I said package so anyway I'm attempting to fix it because that's what I do I just got through tone whoa inappropriate <laughs> oh wait then again Tis the season. Anyway, I'm going to attempt to fix this thing. Hopefully it'll work. I don't have to go and get a new strand just because of one stupid little resistor. Stupid little resistor. I fixed the original problem that I had, and then I put it together and I broke it. <laughs> so I have to do some more solder bridging, but in the process I also found a cold solder joint, which just means that like where the solder goes through the board, where it lays on top of the trace or the other piece of copper, it, it's... Not making good contact. It broke out. So anyway, I'm going to fix this. Um, but I want to say this right now is earlier today. I was trying to think of a nickname for Baby Hellion, Baby Phoenix. I found one. <laughs> he's my little monster. Fitting, I'd say. Especially now that he's been beating you up inside your tummy. All night. <laughs> yeah, it's just like... You almost sound like that kid from Malcolm in the Middle. All night. He's been beating me up. <laughs> Lori Lee just gave away when when the planned cesarean is, and then I had to cut it out. Mwahaha. Uh, but just remember, if she goes in labor before this, before the planned date, then, you know, she's still going to have a C-section. So, you know, any date is still possible. So if you guys want to get in on it, then, you know, post it down in the comments. Um, or, if you have another uh, 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 nickname for Phoenix, you can post that down in the comments, too. Yeah, and don't think it's been a set date, either. It's been changed three times. Yeah. <sighs> Going to the office doctor, say, oh, we have to change it this We have to change it this And not only that, she... <laughs> <laughs> Just get it out! <laughs> not only that, she said that it can be bumped, also. Yeah, if I go into labor, then everybody's scheduled is bumped, and I go first. And vice versa, if the other ones that are scheduled, um, if they have their baby, then she can get bumped back. I'll both. Don't tell her that. So I've got it back together, guys, and right now is the moment of truth. I'm about ready to plug it back in in five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> oh, yeah, I just saved myself 20 bucks on getting a new strand. Yeah! So here we go. <laughs> Here it is, here's the part that I just fixed. So I had I had to take all that, all the guts out of it. And there's like a capacitor and two resistors in there. So, go figure. Anyway, I wanna call outside Christmas lights done for this year. I know, disappointing, it's not as many as I had the year before, but realistically, I'm gonna need to get them down quick and we're gonna have a little bambino. Uh, now I gotta clean up. I really don't understand it at all. Any open box is where you'll catch a cat. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> She's also a scaredy cat. I guess they're like small kids. You get them a toy, they play with the box. You guys haven't seen this because I've had a jacket on because I get kind of cold in the house. And, and look, look at the shirt that Lori Lee got me. 
Is that in frame? Mm hmm Isn't that cool? It is so freaking awesome, and it's long sleeve, and it's nice and comfortable. Anyway, I Once just... Once in a while, it's nice to see you with a little bit of style on. Yeah, instead of just And you lost so much weight through the whole season, and you're like all sexy now and stuff. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, guys, we got a package today, both of us, which is really kind of weird. Itchies. My earring was uh, stabbing me in the back of the head. Oh. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, we know what it is because... There it is right there. It's a freaking high chair for Phoenix. So how cool is that? Awesome. But we don't know exactly who it's from. Or whom it's from. Who it's from. Whatever. Get it, Mika. Get it. Uh, okay, go ahead. I'll pull it out. And you can read it. Don't say anything. Nada? I'm pretty sure that we know who it's from. Um, I'm pretty sure it's from Zach and Jeremy of the Bloodshed Brothers. Uh, they had texted me a couple days ago, several days, like a week ago, and asked me about it. And they said, so for instance, if someone was to get you a high chair, you don't have one yet? So I'm like, um, no. So anyway, guys, um, thank you so much. It's so cool. Oh, okay. This, yeah, this is, it doesn't say anything on it where it comes from... Or anything on the on the packing list. Yeah. So the the gift registry, if if you don't put it on there, then it doesn't it doesn't show who it's from. But just putting two and two together, Zach and Jeremy, thank you guys. So if you haven't already seen them, go check out the Bloodshed Brothers channel. They're how I got my start. So I attribute a lot of a lot of what I do and how I do it to them. I love you guys. You do what to them? Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Well, you know. I know I shouldn't have left you guys in the hotel room back in June. <sighs> wow. You weren't supposed to say anything. To make a long vlog longer, uh, I just want to say, first of all, thank you guys so much for sharing all of your pet names and types and how you got the names. That, that was really cool for me to read that, and it just goes to accentuate that our pets mean a lot. And Popcorn's doing much better today. Her tail's actually not stuck between her legs. Um, and she slept okay last night. So, thank you guys for your concern and your well wishes. But now, now, it's time for... What is it time for? Bed. So, COC. Spooky Norris. My cat was named Spooky. I had her for 13 plus years. She was born near Halloween, hence her name. That's cool. Um, she also got me through a lot of hard times, too. Yeah, and that that's the only pet one that I'm going to read, simply because... The cat's name was Spooky, and, and that ties, thank you, that ties our Halloween vlog together today. Mini Me's cat, um, Sadie. Scab. Yeah. Um, her brother's name, I, I believe it's Spooky. Yeah. It's either Spooky or Shadow, I can't remember. <laughs> but either are, one. Those are two names, Spooky, Shadow, and of course, Salem, for Black Cat's name. Oh. I love Sabrina. The little talking cat. <laughs> oh, God, that was so cool. Wow, I thought you were actually talking about Massachusetts, where I'm from. <laughs> no, I was talking about the cat. <laughs> anyway, um, ABC Noise Tube, did you see that Destry and Jody are closing their haunt in Snohomish and parting with major facades and props? I did see that. I had actually received an email from them about if you wanted to buy anything. And of course, right now, guys, you know, I can't buy nothing. So, um, yeah, but that's really sad that they're packing up shop. Halloweenville? Mailing out your proton pack sometime this week. <laughs> oh, one minute. What? He's You're been, giving Troy what? He's been working on a proton pack. A proton pack? Yes. Oh my goodness. It's not a real one. You don't have to worry about getting hurt. Stop sending Troy more toys that he can endanger his son with. <laughs> <laughs> don't listen to him. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Emerald Gypsy Heart? Poor popcorn. She needs anti-doggy butt meds. I laughed when I saw that. That was funny. And she has them now, too. <laughs> Mr. Trav272. Hey, guys. What's up? Something wrong with YouTube like an error keeps popping up. <laughs> yeah, that's helpful. What's it say? <laughs> well, no. I was thinking, YouTube? Error? Nah, get out of here. <laughs> Um, yeah, sometimes YouTube is kind well, of lame. What's the error? Lame. 
May I help you? Make that go away, Dan. <laughs> I'm going to have to explain the error because yeah. I'd like to know. Fairly useless words. I am so happy Phoenix is nearly here. Yeah. I'm nervous as hell. <laughs> I, I mean, I want him out, but then I'm scared too. It's been 15 years since you've had to change diapers. I know. <laughs> You're changing them all. <laughs> I'm not afraid of a poopy diaper. Doesn't mean I want to do I think it. I'm not afraid but... of a poopy diaper. I'm afraid of the pee pee diaper. <laughs> no, you're afraid of pee coming up after the diaper's I'm afraid, off. I'm afraid the pee coming out when I'm changing the diaper. <laughs> That's what I'm afraid of. Prouse Colin 913. I dressed as a zombie Santa and rang a bell for the Salvation Army. If that's not the Xmas spirit, I don't know what is. That's cool. You would bring in both Halloween and Christmas together. I think a Love lot it. of people, if you, if you did that at Walmart, a lot of people would be, like, offended. Hell yeah. Branson Haunted Hills. Yay for 100 hell points. I'm on a roll. I won Rams Photo Contest, Haunting Ground Sub Contest, and a $100 Visa gift card from a radio station on Facebook. You should let Lorelei move her mouth to your words like you guys did on that one time. That was great. I don't... I would know what... To... It's midnight. That's it! I turn into a pumpkin. Oddities. Looking forward to the coming week and hopefully Phoenix makes his appearance. Oh. <laughs> I'm so scared. Don't but seriously, be scared. We'll we'll do it. Seriously, get out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he comes out and will be like, "Oh my God, get back in!" <laughs> no, no, because I mean, after all the running around all day, even laying on the couch right now is just not even comfortable. I can't get comfortable in any way. No. <laughs> All right, guys. So, we'll see you tomorrow. Make sure to check in. Check in? Make sure to check in. Check in. Check in. All right. Happy haunting, guys. See you tomorrow. I don't know why you keep threatening him like that. Happy haunting. That was another terrifying tear from the hell mouth. Tune in tomorrow, boys and ghouls, for another terrifying chapter. <laughs>